This is the Phoenix, Arizona weather discussion for Wednesday, the 24th of May. I'm Michael Groff. A very hot day today, then temperatures moderating by this weekend. For early next week, we'll see yet another warm up as we head toward meteorological summer. Let's talk about it this morning here just after 8 o'clock. Sunny skies in the valley right now, 84 degrees. It's already very warm out there. Dew points at 34, humidity 16%. The winds are light, the barometer is steady. Temperatures across the area were already climbing into the 80s in many spots. Clear skies on the satellite right now here across Arizona. A few high clouds moving into southern and central California. On the watch warning map, red flag warnings, elevated fire danger throughout much of the southwest, northern and eastern Arizona into New Mexico. Wind advisories throughout the west as well from southern California, northern Arizona, all the way up into the northern Rockies. High wind warnings across parts of Montana. We have severe thunderstorm watches in North Georgia into the Western Carolinas to include places like Atlanta. A tornado watch in North Florida this morning, Tallahassee, Jacksonville, Ocala, Gainesville. On the convective outlook, we've got an enhanced risk of severe storms in many of those same locations from Tampa Bay up to Jacksonville, Savannah, and Charleston, South Carolina. The standard slight risk to include Atlanta, all the way up to Chesapeake, Virginia, and then the marginal risk surrounds that. As far as our weather, here we go. We'll look at the models. This is the GFS, the 06Z run, valid at 5 o'clock Mountain Standard Time today. High pressure flattening out, but the boundary layer remains very warm. Pressure gradient tightening as troughing develops off the Pacific Northwest coast. For us here in the valley today, mostly sunny skies. It'll be a breezy day, windy across southeast California and along the river. I suppose we'll have wind gusts here in the valley getting up to around 20 miles per hour this afternoon. And it'll be hot. Highs right around 107. The record high for today is 109. I think that's safe, but it'll still feel very summer-like out there. Tonight, clear, very warm. Lows in the 70s to near 80. Tomorrow, as troughing continues to deepen off the Pacific Northwest coast, winds will pick up across southeast California and here in Arizona. Afternoon winds tomorrow, 20 to 25 miles per hour. Some patches of blowing dust that you're going to want to watch out for, especially on the I-8 and I-10 corridors heading into SoCal. Highs tomorrow cool off into the upper 90s to about 100. On Friday, we're mostly sunny, but temperatures will continue to cool off as the upper heights come down as troughing settles in throughout the west. All of the main dynamics, and moisture, and energy stay well to the north of Arizona, though. So it's a dry air mass, high temperatures mostly in the low 90s. Same for Saturday, low 90s, the sky's sunny. Sunday, we're in the low to mid 90s as high pressure slowly begins to rebuild. Still some energy diving through the northern and central Rockies, especially as we head into Monday. We see a little bit of green on the map coming into eastern Arizona as a little bit of a backing easterly to southeasterly flow may begin to develop that way. That's at least what's depicted on this run of the GFS. I think this is kind of an outlier. But if that verifies, we're still dry here in the valley, but... Over in the eastern part of the state, yes, could see an isolated shower or thunderstorm. Highs right around 100. Tuesday, high pressure continues to build in. Highs around 100. And here's a week from today. This is Wednesday, the 31st of May. High pressure still across the southwest. Maybe still some unsettled conditions to worry about in the eastern part of our state, but I think we're going to remain dry. And here's Thursday, the 1st of June, the start of meteorological summer. And we should be fairly warm with highs mid-90s to about 100. And then this is the end of the forecast period, Friday, the 2nd of June. See troughing continuing to deepen again in the Pacific Northwest. But that's still a dry look for us. And high temperatures not too far from normal, 95 to 100 or so. And speaking of those temperatures, let's look at the GFS Ensemble, see what it has to say. And for the most part... We're going to look at temperatures at and above normal through most of the period, just to dip this weekend. We'll have to watch for what happens late next week to see if we have another little mini cool down. But you know how it is. We're getting into May and June now. Heart of the dry season, heart of the hot season coming up. And that'll do it for the Phoenix, Arizona weather discussion for today. Our next video back here tomorrow morning. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you like our videos, be sure to subscribe to us. That way you get notifications every time we post a brand new video. Have yourselves a great Wednesday.